I give you raw potato pieces and four separate oils in which to fry these potatoes. I'll give you corn, sunflower, soybean oil, and olive oil. Now what I want you to do with these raw potato pieces is I want you to fry them in temperatures up to 374 degrees and we are going to see which one of these four oils stands the heat the best. Now keep in mind this macadamia nut oil, walnut oil, and hemp oil, but all we're talking about are these four oils and which ones resist oxidative stress the best due to high heat. Well, researchers at the Journal of Agriculture and Food Chemistry, or I should say at least published in that, decided to put these oils to the test to see which one's the best to cook with. In the article titled, Monitoring of Quality and Stability of Characteristics and Fatty Acid Compositions, Refined Oils and Seeds During Repeated Pan and Deep Frying Using GC, FTRNS, and Chemometrics, or in short, olive oil more stable and helpful than seed oils for frying food. They took these four oils, olive, corn, sunflower, and soybean oils, and to put them on raw potatoes and pan fried them 10 times at temperatures up to 374 degrees. The winner of all these oils for the best stability and high heat was olive oil, albeit these were refined oils too, keep that in mind. Olive oil won, the one not so good at the bottom and slightly challenged was the sunflower oil. It was at the bottom of the heap for oxidation. So if you're going to cook or deep fry, or I'll deep fry a lot, I guess, 10 separate times, if you want to look for your best choice, according to the Journal of Agriculture and Food Chemistry, olive oil by far is going to take it away. Thank you very much once again. Ralph Turgiano, signing off.